I've always been a good studier and I think that's something I take pride in is just being a really, really good student in the classroom first and then being an athlete second. He's the, the, the portrait of student athlete. He's always done what he needed to in the classroom and uh, really sets the example there for a men's team on, on what to look for to be a student athlete here. He does everything right from top to bottom. My high school calculus teacher was the inspiration for me wanting to become a math teacher. He was just a really, really awesome guy and he really drove me to be the best I was in the classroom. He is quiet. He's, he's definitely more of a leader by example uh, kid. He does everything right on and off uh, the cross country course. He's a 397 grade point average in, in mathematics. Um, he's just he's kind of the, the kid next door. He's quiet, but he's, he's a hard working Midwest kid. It's just a really fun atmosphere to be a part of this team. Uh, the guys are really laid back, but we really know how to work hard and as a group. I just like to win and I really love to compete. So I think running the summer, you just want to be the best that you can be. Last season in the 5K, I placed third. I was leading for the last uh, 400 until up to the final lap. And then it came down to a sprint and I ended up getting third. So just to be in that position to be winning and have that kind of not work out as I hoped was really just the driving force for my summer training. Well, he's always been uh, a guy that's been a, a leader by example on the team ever since he's been here, uh, even as a freshman. But he's really stepped up his game this summer, put in a lot of miles. Uh, he's been very smart about how he trains and he's just, he's looking really strong and fit right now. And I'm, I'm excited to see how the rest of the season unfolds.